I just want to take a quick moment to say that for anyone wondering where the YouTube content has gone, I'm currently on a pretty big step back from YouTube, but I do stream live every single day on Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash cmwinter. The link is in the comments, the description, it's on the screen right now. I also have a TikTok, which I'm uploading to every other day. It's much easier to upload content there, so if you'd like to check out the TikTok, the link will also be in the comments and a description. Do have a look. But I thought I'd upload this to celebrate 150 plus wins on Pig, somewhere to document it. We'll be talking about it a bit more in the middle of the video, but if you're interested, come along to the Twitch, because the streak is still going. Now, nah, it's all good, boys. If you Now, here's the thing. If you use... If you use third-party, you know, software to, to help you see the game better, all good. For me, it's about, um, I know this game's unbalanced and this game's unfair. I just want to keep it as sportsmanlike as possible. Um, which is, which is funny coming from me because I call everyone a cunt and a dickhead anyway. Uh, but I do not believe in using, uh, third-party software like Crosshairs or Reshade because I believe it is not in the, in the sport of the game. Um, because not everyone can use it, you know? That's why I wish Behaviour would actually bolster the uh, accessibility options in the game. Wow, this is exciting. Someone's found the god loop. God, they kept breaking my chase as well. That's brutal. Wow, she is getting the best RNG. Oh, okay, she's not looking. That is someone who knows all the best loops, but doesn't know that they need to look at the killer to time them properly. <laughs> Kayla, The Walking Dead came out like 10 years ago, bro. I don't think there's any rush on finishing those achievements. Whoa. That's a fucking yikes. Oh, yeah. That was a one minute Money's chase. Ho, oh, oh. Tonight I saw a woman reject a young lad, so he decided to set her hair on fire. How's everyone else's night been? Will loss of one blush. Interesting. Plonk works at a bar, uh, a pub, which in America you know as a fucking bar or whatever. And someone set someone's hair on fire. Interesting. Thank you for the hundred bits, Plonk. That sounds like a pretty nice time. Look, I'm a bit worried because this gen here is 99. And this girl's about to go second stage now, so... God damn it, fine. You can have the gen and I get the hook. There you go. You get the. You can have the gen, I'll get the hook. Two gens! Quite quickly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait! Darn! I just want to give you a deep wound. Once again, we're going for the no mind game because we have off the record. I just want to give you a deep wound. Okay, cool. Whatever. Great. That was one chase for basically two gens because a gen got done and that gen was 99, so... There's Meg. Are you self-caring? Man, those gens were quite quick for RPD, I must say. She healed even better. I forget. We still need to fucking win. I completely forgot. We're 150 in. I still need to fucking win here. So where would she be? Would she be on this one? So is this Nancy? Or Ada? That's Ada. Yep, somehow I got into a chase with Ada, even though I was crouched for four seconds. If you crouch for three or four seconds, you will usually stop yourself getting into a chase while you are crouched, uh, which means you can be a bit cheeky with their traps. We know that she has checked one box, and that's, that's probably it, I'd assume. Uh, and then she ran in this direction, so, like, this one, I guess. 
She probably has less than a minute on her box now. Here we go. Oh, Nancy just killed her. Oh. How the fuck is she dead that quick? Still in a chase with Ada, by the way. There we go. Yeah, this is for the fucking... This is for the new boys. This is, uh... Oh, hello. No! Hey, could you go away? Thank you. Where's Ada gone? Here she is. There we go, GG boys. I actually didn't use many map offerings during this streak. I'd say I probably used less than 10. So I was actually right, there was exactly 10 map offerings used. And I'm almost certain, because I counted, I've written all these down. Every single one of those was a channel point redeem from the Twitch stream. Which means people can pay channel points for me to do Amanda's letter and then I do an indoor map. Or they can pay 100,000 channel points for RPD. So 10 out of 150 were map offerings by me, uh, but with the caveat that I would have two traps or whatever. Um, I used the same add-ons uh, pretty much the whole way through, double gears, because I think they're the most consistent. And out of 150 wins, 106 of them were 4Ks. The rest of them were 3Ks, with 29 of those 3Ks being hatches and only 15 being the door. However... If I let someone go through the hatch or the door, I just counted it as hatch or door. So it's actually even less than that. I'd I'd be willing to say that at least 10 of those you could knock off and just count as a 4k. I just couldn't be bothered counting them as and then explaining. But I'm explaining it anyway here. So um, if I let someone go through the door or through the hatch, I did count it as a door and hatch, not as a 4k. So 106 plus out of 150 were 4k's. 44 were made up of hatch or door 30 of those were hatch which is pretty fucking crazy if you ask me i just double checked and i uploaded the first streak on april 15th 2021 it is now may 29th 2023 over two years later and not a single person has ever come to me to say that they beat my streak except me it has been two years that's how long it took <laughs> And I finally felt that after the dead hard nerf, after the circle of healing nerf, after the medkit nerf, all in one go, I was like, I feel a bit more confident about actually playing for wins now. Usually, because the get the stack was so decked, because the stack was so decked against the killer, I didn't really feel like there was any point going for 3Ks or 4Ks or overextending his killer, especially on pig or weaker tier uh, characters. So I used to just go for 2Ks and be happy with it because the game was so goddamn unbalanced and now the game feels like you're actually rewarded for chasing although my playstyle on pig is definitely a bit more defensive still um i felt like now was the time to go for a uh, streak 3ks and 4k sounds like fun the old streak is a little bit different as you'll see in the video but a nice little retrospective right here once again quickly come along to the twitch twitch.tv for slash cm winter Whoa. and all of the traps all of the medkits sorry what the fuck am i saying all of the uh, maps I actually used uh, were mostly for Amanda's letter, which were channel point redeems. So this is 151. I'd say the majority of map offerings um, were... So we have a channel point redeem here where you redeem 30,000 channel points and we do one Amanda's letter game per day. And obviously if you do Amanda's letter, you have to go to an indoor map. So I'd say probably 10 or so of those were um, Amanda's letter, and then it's all, also between, you know, 3Ks and 4Ks, uh, but people were allowed to get the door, which was not the case for the old streak. For the old streak, before MMR came out, if any, I won 143 games in a row, and if anyone opened the door and escaped, the streak was over. Whereas in this one, during MMR, we now allow it so that you can um, uh, if anyone escapes, as long as you get a free care of 4k, you still win. You want mid or thing? Come on, bro. Oh no! David's doing the gens! I actually, I have 2,000 hours on pig. I don't know what the beeping means. 
So this is the furthest it will go, but I don't know what this means. Apparently it's based on a percentage. I think that means- does that mean 25%? Because there's four diff- is there four different types of beeping? There might be three different types as well, I'm not sure. Oh, that's a shame. It's 25%. Kind of weird, one person getting gate was a loss back then. Were people really that bad? No, it was because there was no MMR in the game. And then once MMR came out, it wasn't... So, the it wasn't because people were so bad. It was because we didn't realize how fucking hard the game would be when MMR finally came out. Right? So, when MMR came out, people tried to do streaks. And if anyone... If anyone escaped through the door, they were like, this is impossible. It's why insert big streamer... Uh, once MMR came out, he couldn't do 50 wins in a row. He could, I, I don't think, uh, insert streamer who does the, the 50 win streak videos could even do 50 on pig once MMR came out. So everyone just stopped. And then when people started it back, they said, okay, 3Ks and 4Ks will count as a win now. Which is fair, that makes sense, because in the, um, in the lore of DBD, um, or in the, or sorry, in the lore of DBD's development, uh, Behavior have come out and said that they they base the wins on kills now, not hooks. They've come out and said numerous times that it goes from you know emblems to hooks to wit to kills and blah blah blah. And the way the pendulum is currently swung is based on kills, I think. He got thirty and never re retried. The funny part is I got forty on my first try. That's the that's the funniest part about that. And people will always ask me, hey, what about plaything on pig? Nah. Nah, bro, that's why you're fucking losing. I got 40 on my first fucking try.